All right, so we're, uh, we're going to have a quick talk about the uh, poll question that Greedo put up last week, uh, which was, which character from the upcoming Ahsoka series are you most looking forward to seeing? And uh, we promised we would discuss the uh, the results in the next episode, and here we are. So uh, <laughs> the choices were Ezra Bridger, Sabine Wren, Hera and Chopper, Grand Admiral Thrawn, and Balin and Shin. And the results came in with a resounding 60% for Grand Admiral Thrawn. <laughs> I don't think it was it's almost like there. Grand Admiral Thrawn, you know, like uh, loaded the deck on this one. Like, yeah, I think so, yeah. <laughs> I think he had some bots voting for him. Yeah, coming in at a very distant second place was Ezra. <laughs> very distant. 17%. <laughs> yeah. And, and let's just let's just call these let's call these 17% the optimists of the yes. universe. <laughs> because we don't yeah. even know if we're going to get Ezra at all. But, yeah. but, uh, right. but they're the to, they're clinging to hope that he's gonna show up and <laughs> great exactly <laughs> and then uh tied for third at nine percent sabine and Hera and chopper mm -hmm. yeah um and then we've got coming in uh last at five percent was uh balen and shin which i'm very intrigued by those characters no I, that's I was, almost that's almost my number one after seeing yeah the i was pretty intrigued yeah. by them on the based on the the trailer that we watched Mm -hmm. I think it's. I think this may be a, a worthy villain that Greedo's been clamoring for for, some, for such a long <laughs> <Right>. time. <laughs> yeah, it's like it. It looks like um, what was it? What was it called? Uh, action guy and hit girl from yeah. Kick Ass or whatever. Yeah. Yeah. I forget. Girl, I forget. Yeah. I, no, he was an action guy. He was something else. But he was yeah, like yeah. But I know what you meant. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. They 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 look kind of like that. Like no nonsense. Yep. We we solve our problems in a straightforward, very straightforward <laughs> right. way. Uh, and they were just wrecking a, a Republic ship or whatever they were doing. So I, I'm all in favor of that. Yeah. <laughs> uh, are yeah. you willing to reveal your vote? So who you voted for? I voted I for Grand Admiral Throne. I voted yeah. for Grand Admiral Throne. <laughs> I voted yeah. for Hera and Chopper. Really? There you go. Yeah, that's a good that's choice. Excellent. That's good. Yeah, yeah, that is a good choice. I, I'm on, honestly, I can't wait to see Chopper. I would have had Chopper alone. I had him alone in the poll at first, but then they only give you like five options. Five options. So I had to yeah. combine Hera and Chopper. I thought they're probably going to be a team in yeah, a lot of their exactly. scenes. So um, I, 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 I want to see all of these. That's the thing. It's not like mm -hmm. I don't want to see the others. I just want to no, see Grand just... Admiral Thrawn more because I've been yeah. following his character for 30 years. You know? Yeah. 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 I'm excited about seeing Thrawn um, ever since the name drop in the, the Jedi episode in Mandalorian. Um, but it's something about, I don't know, that everybody wants that. And I was mm. really excited to see a live action hero. That was what really got yeah. me in that trailer. And I, I also am wondering if we're going to see her son. I just have a thing. Where I want oh, to right. See You've been where bringing her up. Because right, right. yeah. right. they did have a son kid. at the end of Rebels. Yeah. You're right. Yeah. yeah. And who, who, is this kid uh, force sensitive, you know, and stuff right. like that? I want to know those kind of things. So I'm well, hoping maybe the kid will make him. I, will they pull a fast one and will Kanan appear as a, uh -huh. either a flashback or a, a, or a ghost show? Yeah. yeah. I oh, could see, that the, that I could see them flashing back to his spoilers, people. Uh, to his yeah. death scene and giving us <laughs> that moment in in live action uh oh, like wow. for just a second oh, uh cool. like like her you know when she's alone her f thinking about how he how he died right. um would uh, you know would be awesome and yeah of course if the kid is there he's got to be around somewhere right yeah and, gotta and, be, yeah uh, um but no i'm looking forward to all of them but i think these that with feloni in charge and and I guess Favreau too, but I think Filoni probably loves these characters, you know, yeah, Ezra, does, Sabine, yeah. Hera, Chopper. He always says Chopper, right? Mm -hmm. um, so I think those characters are going to come out really well. I don't have a lot of doubts about them. And also they're not, um, they only have rebels as a foundation. They could go places without offending me with these characters. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like they're in an unknown era of their lives that we haven't seen yet. So naturally yeah. they're going to have changed and everything. And I'm not, is going to be married to some kind of narrow vision of the characters. So I'm going to be willing to accept more with them. So I'm not worried about them. Grand Admiral Thrawn is really high stakes. I mean, yeah. <laughs> this is possibly, I mean, this is a character that saved Star Wars almost, you know, uh, yeah. in an era when Star there was no Star there Wars. There was no Star Wars. Really. Yeah. This, mm -hmm. when it, this character ignited a whole generation and the generation that saw the movies that was looking for more con con uh, continuity. Yeah. And I mean, it's an important character and mm, we, we Star Wars has, has failed to give us the next Darth Vader or the next um, Palpatine. Mm. And they keep leaning on the past. And here's a guy that could just knock it out of the park. 
you know, mm -hmm. and be bigger than a series, bigger than everything. And and kind of like Grogu that, for the good has, guys, you know. He has the ability to unite generations of Star Wars fans too. Exactly. Because yeah, we've got all the people who love the expanded universe that's now legends, you know, can we could if they bring in even more of the legend stuff than they've been doing, um, I'm sure everybody that loves expanded universe would really enjoy that. So yeah. there's all kinds of opportunities for appealing to many different types of Star Wars fans with that character. So yes, I'm, looking, they, I'm looking forward to it. <laughs> they also need to win over people that don't know Admiral Grand Admiral yeah, Thrawn. Yeah. That's the and, thing so, too. Yeah, yeah. There's Not a much bigger audience out like there. Have, yeah, yeah. There's a much bigger audience out there than that, and they so they need to hit a home run with this and give us an antagonist that people love to hate. And Thrawn's perfect because he's he's an antihero. You know, he's not a true horrible villain you right know? Villain, yeah. yeah and um um but he's dealing with a lot of evil around him you know that he has to control and everything mm -hmm. and so i don't know i that character to me is the most pivotal one i have, I have faith in ahsoka i think when i saw her on screen i was like that's her you know yeah, that's I, 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 we were all yeah. sold nothing to nitpick or like oh that doesn't yeah. look right or yeah she's not as as joyful and girlish as the character was but, but she's, she's a lot older yeah, and she's, she's a, a lot woman of yeah rough she's life, woman. <laughs> rough life experiences mm -hmm. that have she just survived a lot her. yeah mm -hmm. and, and exactly. so I, I thought it was a natural it just felt right and I, I have a feeling a lot of this will feel right they just need to get the story right they need to have some compelling action there and most of all i think that thrawn you know you have someone to go up against it makes your antagonists much more compelling yeah it, it, um you know when you're doing like the mandalorian does and you have pirate moss beard or whatever <laughs> <laughs> it's fun it's fun but it, it doesn't get you invested like moff gideon does you know so <laughs> anyway. oh, and I, also, I also want to note we didn't get to include it in the poll but i'm psyched to see the magistrate is back yeah. And I'm hoping that that's we'll cool. A, a yeah. few cool martial arts scenes. I really I'd like to see that. Too, I hope yeah. we get to see her fight again. So mm -hmm. that will that would that would be, be cool. Somebody in the comments said whoever Ray Stevenson is playing, which I think they meant Balon. Mm -hmm. Um, and I agree. Ray Stevenson's awesome. I've been a yeah. fan of his since the series Rome. Uh, twenty year over twenty years, maybe twenty years now. I'm not sure. Uh, and somebody else said Vandu. I'm not sure who Vandu is. Mm -mm. Either that's yeah, a joke I'm not or sure who that is. Yeah. This is testing the limits of our knowledge. Yeah. <laughs> <Fail>. <laughs> but uh, yeah, uh, 61% Grand Admiral Thrawn. And I pretty much agree. But so there you go. That's our uh, our latest poll. And um, we'll be putting some more up uh, having to do with the latest Star Wars news and what and whatnot. And if people participate, we will address them, the polls, as we go along. Yep, absolutely. Thanks, thanks for participating. Yep, thanks for voting. Yeah, thanks a lot. Appreciate yeah. it.